hello everyone today I will continue upgrading my bike and I'm, I will try to attach a dynamo dynamo to the bike so I can have lights and what I'm holding in my hands yes this is a dynamo so we'll start first with attaching it to the bike as you can see they give me this kind of braces so as you can see the hole is quite small and usually the dynamo is attached to the front wheel somewhere here right but it would be a problem in my case because the braces are too small it will not fit here so this fork is too fat so i decided to attach it to the back okay so let's attach it to the back wheel it's very important to attach the dynamo in the right direction so it can lean towards the wheel towards the tire because this cog wheel needs to touch the touch the tire so it will generate electricity so look there is a kind of a... wow it's so windy today it's super windy today but what i'm trying to show you that yes there is a kind of a button here if you press this button see what's happened it leaned to forward so it has to lean towards the tire so don't put it this way don't put it the, the opposite way because it will lean in the opposite direction so it must be this way leaning towards the tire and if you want it back you just press this button again yep and it will return to its position these nuts are moving while you're turning them so it's good to use pliers or another spanner to stop on the other side stop them on the other side so you can tighten them well so i have achieved the desired effect please take a look now this cog wheel is touching the tire and if I move the bike wheel the dynamo is also moving yeah it's moving yep it's being moved so it will generate electricity they give me light with only one wire which is positive terminal every circuit needs to have positive terminal and negative terminal just like when you have a light bulb and a battery wire has to touch at the back of the battery which is negative terminal and top of the battery which is positive terminal plus and minus so in here the bottom bottom of the dynamo is positive terminal in my case everything which goes here on the left side is negative terminal so this uh, frame metal frame this is negative terminal so that's why it's enough to connect only wire at the bottom here and if I connect the light to this uh, metal frame it will create circuit so let's try it out yes we can see the light so it's working all what we have to do attach the light to the frame of metal frame of the bicycle and we'll create a circuit but if I hold it if I hold the light separately it will not work because we need positive and negative terminal hope you find it helpful and you can connect your dynamo enjoy your ride bye for now